Hads, what are we going to draw today? A boat. Yes. A sailboat? Yes. Perfect. All right, Hads, you got your marker? Yes. We hope you guys are going to follow along with us. You have something to draw with and a piece of paper in front of you. We're using a Sharpie and a regular printer paper. Two sheets, because we don't want the Sharpie to go through to the table, right? Mm -hmm. Yes, and we're going to work on a shape today. What shape are we going to work on? A triangle. Yes, we're going to practice drawing a triangle. We're going to draw three triangles. How many sides does the triangle have? Three. Three sides, yes. You ready to draw this? Yes. Okay, first step, we're going to do the water, and we're going to draw it down here at the bottom. You remember how we draw water? Mm -hmm. We've done it a couple times. We're going to draw a bunch of U's around, that are connected along the bottom of our paper. Done. You beat me. <laughs> Good job, Hads. Give me five. Boom. All right, okay, now let's draw the boat. And so we're gonna do a line that comes straight across, okay? We're gonna start here, and we're gonna, I'm gonna draw it this way so I can draw it straight without wobbles. There we go. We draw the line straight across, kind of in the middle of our paper. Yeah, and you can do points. And you can connect the points. You wanna turn it sideways? Points. <laughs> points. I got a point. <laughs> you got two points. You're winning. Good job. And we like turning our paper when we're drawing a straight line so that you can pull the marker towards you and that and that makes it pretty straight, huh? Mm -hmm. We didn't even use a ruler. It looks awesome. Ready to keep going? Yes. All right, okay, let's draw the bottom of the boat. We're gonna draw a line that comes in, connects to the water. Good, and then we're gonna draw another line on this side that connects to the water over here. Perfect, Tads. Now we're gonna draw the middle of the boat and this is the mast. We're going to draw another line that goes straight up and down into the boat. Like that. Good. And another point. You got two more points. You're winning. Three more points. Three more points. <laughs> okay, now let's draw the other line next to it, okay? We're going to draw a line right next to it that comes down. And you can get wider if you want towards the bottom. See how it's close at the top and then kind of far apart at the bottom? And you don't have to do that if you don't want to. There you go. And connect them. I have four points. Four points. Okay, now let's put a little circle up at the top. That's for the top of our mast. Five points. <laughs> okay, now we're going to draw our first triangle. This one's going to be super small, okay? We're going to draw a little line right next to our mast. Yes, you could draw it a little taller. So this is going to be one side, and this is going to be the flag coming off the mast. All right, so we're going to draw. We can do a one point out here. Let's do it the same way you've been doing it. Good, and then we're going to connect it. We're going to draw out to the point, and then connect back to the other side. Yes, look at that. It's a tall triangle, huh? We turn it that way. Does it look like it's blowing in the wind, too? You ready for the next triangle? Yes. All right, we're going to do the same thing, except this one's going to be really long. Here we go. We're going to draw it right next to the mast. Come all the way down to the boat. And that's going to be one side of our triangle. Good heads. Hey, now I'm going to turn my paper this way, and I'm going to draw a straight line that comes off the bottom. And what letter does that make? Yes, it does. A big L, huh? You can turn it sideways. There you go. Perfect. Now we're going to connect the top of the L with the bottom of the L. Here we go. The straight line. Like that. Is that pretty neat? So we're going to connect from that point down to that point. You want to turn it sideways? You can turn it like that. And you can Perfect. Okay, now we're going to do another triangle on this side. We're going to do the same thing. Draw a line down the mast. Stop in the same spot. There you go. Good job. And then we're going to draw a backwards L, right? Draw another line down here. Good. And then let's connect it. Here's the third side. We did it. That's our boat. That was pretty easy, huh? Mm -hmm. Now we could do a couple other things. We could draw a guy in our boat. 
We could also draw a sun and we could draw some seagulls. Should we do that? Mm -hmm. And we can speed it up a little bit, okay? Okay. Good job, heads. Was that fun drawing the background? Uh-huh. We also, we did a sun and we also did, uh, what do these lines look like? Seagulls. Yes, they look like birds kind of off in the distance. And then we also put a person in ours, huh? Mm -hmm. Did you put a girl in yours? Mm -hmm. I like the little heart. And I put a guy in mine. He looks like Asta Wasta, huh? Mm -hmm. Yes, he does. All right, should we color it? Yes. Okay, let's do it. Had skip it five. Another one. Did you have a lot of fun? Yes. Yes, you did an awesome job coloring yours in, and I think it's awesome that you did it all by yourself. And you even had a cool idea. What's this? Island. An island. I love it. You drew that all by yourself. You did such a good job. What shape did we work on? Do you remember? A triangle. A triangle. And how many sides does a triangle have? Three. Yes, three sides. Good job. And it's okay that our boats look different, huh? Because what's the most important thing? Having fun. Yes, and we hope you guys had a lot of fun drawing your boats with us. We want to see a picture of how they turned out, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, take a photo of your drawing and send it to us. What's our email address again? Myart at artforkidshub.com. Yes, myart at .com. And remember to always ask for a parent's permission before sending us an email. And we'll see you later, art friends. Goodbye. Bye. Come kiss. Oh, I love it. Okay, keep it forever.